Well, this is another first in the world of surgery, the transplant of a gene edited pig kidney along with a mechanical heart pump was completed this week on a 54 year old woman who had no other medical options. Mandy Gaither explains what this surgery could mean for the future of treating chronic diseases. When that opportunity first came to me, I was like, I gotta try it. From her bed in the intensive care unit at NYU Langone, Lisa Pisano says she's optimistic about the outcome of her surgery, which combined a mechanical heart pump and a transplant of a gene edited pig kidney. I feel the best I've felt in a long time. Pisano said she'd exhausted all other medical resources. She had heart failure and end stage kidney disease, but couldn't have a standard heart or kidney transplant due to other chronic medical conditions and the overall lack of donor organs in the US. She only had weeks to live. Dr. Robert Montgomery, who led the surgery, says the gene edited pig kidney was a match and an immediately available organ option. We didn't know if it would work, but we had circumstantial evidence to believe that it would, and it did. Experts say xenotransplants, which put animal organs into people, are crucial to solving the organ shortage. Gene editing also allows for precise edits to a pig's DNA to help keep the human body from recognizing the animal's organs as foreign and rejecting them. While Pisano has a long way to go, her doctor says she's doing well. The worst case scenario, if it doesn't work, it might work for the next person. At least somebody's going to benefit from it. For Health Minute, I'm Andy Gaither. That is fascinating.